What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my 100% playthrough of Doom 2's The Master Levels on Ultra Violence. This is map 14, Blood Sea Keep. And we get a hot start right off the bat, so we're gonna grab the shotgun, go through this door, grab some shells, go right through this door. We'll take out these two imps, and then we'll take out the two pinkies. Let's take out that pinky, too. Alright, so we have a Baron, and he likes to teleport, and he can teleport here, he can teleport over in there, he can teleport over here. Hopefully he'll teleport here, we can take care of him pretty early. But in the meantime, let's take out these imps. There he is, perfect. I like to take him out here because it's a lot easier. It's kind of boring with the regular shotgun, but... This way we can take care of him early on and he won't bother us. As long as I can actually hit him. Oh, that was a big hit. That's alright though. We're gonna grab some health right here. Let's take out the Kako Demon right there. Probably the most annoying part of this level is all the wandering lost souls. Having to deal with all of them. Alright, let's take out the two imps guarding the red key there. Then we're gonna open this, another lost soul. Open this right here. Let's take out the pinky right there. Alright, we're going to hit this switch to lower the red key. Let's grab it and head in here. We're going to head over here, grab some armor. And then let's take out the imps up here. Hopefully we don't get hit from behind by that lost soul. There we go. Alright, so we have some specters and imps to take out. Another lost soul. We can grab a stem pack right in here. Just grabbed it like that. And we're also gonna go in here, hit this switch to open the super shotgun, which we'll grab later. Got some more lost souls. I heard, I heard you. Where are you? Could have sworn I just heard. Ah, there he is. All right, let's head through the red door here. Take out this specter. Grab the berserk pack. And then we'll head up these stairs. Take out all of these shotgunners. And then we're gonna head out here. Take out three imps in here, guarding the blue key. And they're also guarding an invulnerability, which we're gonna use. To head out here and traverse the damaging blood. Head all the way over here. There's a mancubi, or a mancubus, guarding it. the rocket launcher. We'll use three rockets, finish them off with this shotgun gonna open up this area right here for a secret for the chain gun and hopefully we can just save the ammo go through the teleporter all right now we're gonna head up here there's gonna be a baron that's gonna teleport directly in front of you so get ready for that I like to use two rockets and then finish them off with the shotgun getting stuck on that pedestal there though could have been bad. There we go. Let's head in here. Two imps at the end. One of them guarding some shells, which we're gonna grab. And then we're gonna open this up for a 
our secret mega armor. And then let's use the chain gun to take out lost souls in here. And there's a Kako Demon down here, so we're going to wake him up. Chain got him a little bit. Finish him off with the shotgun. And then we'll get a radiation suit to rise up. We don't really need it, though, so we're just going to leave it. We're going to head over here. In that pit, there is a pain elemental. So let's wake him up. down there. I think we got him. So let's head over here, take out the shotgunner in the fireplace. There's some health right there. We're not going to grab that. We don't really need it with only 4% missing. Let's open up the back here. Watch out for the specter that teleports behind you. Now we'll grab this. But we got some lost souls wanting to come and join the party. Head in here, it is mandatory, because we have to hit this switch right here. And I guess, let's grab that radiation suit. Just so we can head down here. You heard that pain elemental. We're gonna use this ammo to take him out. punch this specter and we're up here in the top of the library that super shotguns right there it is booby trapped so grab it and get out so you don't get crushed oh I didn't mean to drop down there let's head back over here head over to this side here and we can run across grab the yellow key We'll head back up here and we're gonna go to an optional area right in here let's grab some shells and then take out two imps and then watch out in these cages there are some zombie men that will snipe you and let's head in here we're gonna use two rockets and then finish off the hell knight with the super shotgun and grab the supercharge there. All right, if this door closes behind you, the way to open it is just punch this corpse and it'll open it up. Let's grab some ammo out of these cages before we move on. And head down here. All right, what you want to do is run all the way to the end of this hallway and stay there because two crushers are going to activate behind you and they're slow moving. They will kill you. So just run to the end, stay here, and just do your best to take out the imps and then take out the revenant right here. And then get ready for a bunch more hit scanners in these cages that you can barely see. As soon as you step in and fire, it's going to wake up everything. You want to concentrate on the chain gunner there. And then some shotgunners. And this area is tagged as a secret. And it is going to be the final secret of the level. some ammo just to stock up on shells as well as chain gun ammo of course all right we should be good we grabbed the rockets so now we can get out of here head back over here and we're gonna go through the blue door right here there's two pain elementals inside so I like to hug the one side so I can Wake up the one pain elemental. And now we'll wake up.
pick up the second one. Get him to come over here. Alright, let's grab one box of shells. We're gonna go through the yellow door here. And there's gonna be a little spot. There's four corners. There's a Hell Knight and Crushers in each corner. So what I like to do is just run in, run back out. It's not gonna let me out. Well, that went badly. Usually I like to back directly out of the door again. But you can't get out until you activate a switch over there, I believe. Anyways, we got the four Hell Knights anyways. So we're going to go up here. There's four switches in the four corners, guarded by four crushers. First one you can hit, and then just back right out. This one as well, you should be able to just run in and run out but these ones are a little bit faster so you may have to wait at the switch and then turn around and get out this one right here there's two pinkies in the corners here you can see the crusher is not going down in that one spot there and that one spot there so what I like to do is wait for the crusher to go up go in wake them up and then just back all the way out and let them get crushed except for this one right here seems to have escaped so let's punch him out all right this final switch here again this crusher is quite fast so you might have to wait right here and I got crushed anyways of course anyways we have all four switches we just have one enemy left right up here there's gonna be an arch file and of course we're gonna miss some of those rockets anyways we took him out so let's hit this switch that's gonna open up this right here and then we'll head back up and eventually this wall is going to open up. We can hit this switch. And this is the exit. Check one more time. All the kills. All the secrets. Let's hop in there and end the level. Alright guys. So that is Blood Sea Keep. 100% kills and secrets. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to hit that like button. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe as it really helps out. And I'll see you guys next time.